Hi, in this video we are going to learn how to find a given percent of a given value. So as you can see I have noted down the problem. Problem is find 20% of 600. Right? So 20% of 600. So first let's write this 20% into fraction. What is 20%? 20% is nothing but the numerator of the fraction whose denominator is 100, right? So 20% of 600 will be written as 20 by 100 of 600, right? And this will be written as 20 by 100 times 600, right? This fraction actually denotes the part of a whole, right? And in the same ratio, we have to find the value out of 600. So it will be 20 by 100 multiplied by 600, right? We replace off by a multiplication sign, right? And then we will solve this expression further. This 0 will cancel this 0 and this 0 will cancel this 0. It is nothing but dividing both numerator and denominator by 100. And this will be equal to 6 to the 12, 120 right and this can also be understand in one more method right what is that method that is unitary method so let's use that I'll solve it at this side 20% is what 20% is nothing but if I take an object something like this and divide it into 100 parts they will be very 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 small parts and I take 20 parts out of that that will be 20% right so 20% is nothing but out of 100, we take 20 parts, right? Then out of 1, we will be taking 20 by 100. Yes, we are using unitary method. And then out of 600, it will be equal to 20 by 100 multiplied by 600, right? And again, if we solve it, it will be zeros will cancel all these zeros and it will again be 6 to the 12 and 1 0 120 right so this is the longer method but when you have lesser time to find a percent value you you can directly use this method 20 percent is nothing but 20 by 100 right the fractional value of this percent and 20% of 600 will be nothing but 20 by 100 multiplied by 600 and we get the same expression using unitary method also right so this is the shortcut and this is the systematic way of unitary method of finding the value right so this is one example and after this we are going to take one more example so let me erase all this yes so the next example as you can see is we have to find 40% of 540 right 40% can be written as 40 by 100 in fractions because percent is nothing but the numerator of a yes fraction whose denominator is 100 right so 40% of 540 will be nothing but 40 by 100 multiplied by 540 right and if I divide both numerator and denominator by 10 this 0 will cancel this 0 and this 0 will cancel this 0 right and this will be equal to 4 4 is a 16 1 carried forward 4 5 is a 20 plus 1 21 that is equal to 216 liters right next we have to find the 13 percent of dollar 30 right so what will it be 13 percent is nothing but 13 my 100 in fractions and we have to find 13 percent of 30 that means we have to multiply this by 30 because fraction is the part of a whole right and now what we have to do yes we have to solve it further so in this case this 0 will cancel this 0 and we will get a value in fraction again 13 multiplied by 3 is 3 3 is a 9 3 1 is a 3 divided by 10 and this is nothing but 3.9 right so 13 percent of dollar 30 is nothing but 3.9 dollars right so this is the value 
and now I think it's very clear to you how to find the given percent of the given value right in next few videos of course as you know we are going to take a few word problems based on percentage right so bye bye till then